All right, so we see I have the console looking quite delectable. I'm not adding any extra brightness, any extra contrast, or none of that through the capture card software through OBS. This is just strictly how it's coming into the situation. So if you're having issues with your quality not looking great, the things that you're going to have to do is, one, you want to make sure that off top, you want to go into settings, you want to go into your video output section. You want to change this from auto detect. Put that on HDMI just so it doesn't be doing no weird stuff. You want to choose the color bit that your actual monitor can handle. And then as far as your actual color space, you see I have PC RGB and you see my blacks look real crisp, real nice. So if I switch this back to standard, it's going to get a little bit washed out. And that's why the game looks like crap. That's why our games aren't looking like they're supposed to look. So if I switch back to the game, and then go back in like it may be subtle to tell but you can really tell on your monitor It's really not going to change as far as too much for the stream but it does help but this is how to get it right for you how you're looking at it so you can see it the exact way you're supposed to see it so i'm going to go back in and change that because that is outrageous i don't have time for that switch anyway and then as far as video modes, I have none of these selected because I'm on a 1080p monitor, so I don't select none of that. 1080p is what I select here. 60 hertz is what I select there. Selecting 60 hertz and making sure it's 1080p like it's supposed to be. Also make sure that my capture card works perfectly with my OBS streaming and recording software. Now those settings will work on just getting your Xbox to look better, point blank, period. So you don't have to change any settings in your actual game.